guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be looking some very, very close calls. Okay, so this guy seems to be in the literal middle of the sea. Why are the waves like that? Why is he out in the sea? Please don't tell me it's going to crash over the boat and he's going to get sucked in. Oh my god, I hate these videos. Is the boat going down? Hello? Oh my god, is he sinking? <gasps> Shut up. Why is he out in the ocean when the water's like that? Yeah, he does look like he's in trouble. Oh my god, that's literally how you drown. Wow, I think he was able to get above the waves. Jesus. Oh my gosh. First of all, why is he out in that water? And second of all, why did people let him? I don't know where that is in the world, but that is not like big shit wave behavior. If it was like a big massive cruise, then it would have been fine, but not a small fishing boat like that. I've been out fishing a few times in my dad's boat and trust me, whenever it gets stormy, it's scary. Okay, so I'm gonna flip this video. Oh my gosh, what? Never mind, I'm not gonna flip it. I hope that didn't hit anyone down there. Oh my god, apparently that just cliff just like collapsed. A big chunk fell off. And boom, it hits the water. Now imagine if that was your body. Imagine you fell like that. I used to be obsessed with rock climbing whenever I was younger. I'm not obsessed with it anymore because that would happen to me and it'd fall. Okay, so this is people skiing. And look how close they get under. This is so tight. I've been skiing quite a few times and trust me, I could not do that. Also, that isn't snow. That was like ice. Can we look? I'm going to replay that. Look at this. This is not snow. Right, so look. They're currently going under. That is literal ice that they're skiing on. Do you not know how hard it is to do that? I've been skiing a few few times I think free and I can barely do it in snow but he's doing it in ice. These people better be sponsored by like Red Bull or something like that because they're actually putting their life at risk. Oh my god what are you doing? Why would you do that? So right now I'm What are you really? doing? Am I the only one who, like, literally hears him saying, ah? Oh my god, he's scraping his head. He's literally underground. There was also a man who used to do stuff like this years ago somewhere in the world. And basically, he got stuck. People tried to save him for, like, a day. They basically had to give up and they closed over the cave he went into. So his skeleton is in that cave. I don't understand why he'd ever want to do something like that. Like, this is actually making me feel kind of claustrophobic. This man is literally in a cave under the ground. Why is he doing this for enjoyment? Okay, I'm hoping that he made it out in the end. I don't know if he did. I really hope he did. But yet again, why do white men love doing that? Why can't they just be obsessed with Fortnite? Of course they have to go into caves. Oh my god, my heart nearly went down my asshole. That was not on target. That was so close to hitting the house. I'm telling you right now, one gust of wind, one fart from a deer in the forest, it would have taken the whole house out. Also, aren't them tree people called tree surgeons where they like cut down trees? I think it's really nice whenever you walk into a forest and there's like a house in the forest. I'd just be scared of bears and trees like that collapsing on the house. I've seen this clip before, look at under the water, a literal shark. And look, it's gonna come up in a second. Oh wait. That's not a shark, that's an octopus. It's gonna slap him or like stick it in. Oh my god, I was thinking this was a shark video. It's taking him down. Why are you doing that? Why are you trying to catch an octopus? First of all, why are they literally laughing and giggling about that? That's not funny. That's an octopus. Some things literally squirt ink or is that squids? It's one of them too, but I swear they literally have big tentacles that will wrap around you and like sink you into the ground. You're playing with fire, mate. Look, they're literally all laughing when it's trying to drag him under. Oh my God, smack its tentacle. Give it a big boom. Oh my God, its tentacles remind me of spiders. They're literally water spiders, aren't they? Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it. That was the end of that clip. I hope he made it out alive. Thank God it wasn't a stingray. Nah, I'm sorry to actually freak me out. They are like underwater spiders. It's the legs and the tentacles. Ugh, I hate it. Now, why would you do this? I see videos like this all the time. It's the Russians. No, don't put the phone over the edge. 
Oh, I'm going to vomit. I'm going to barf. I mean, it looks beautiful. I'd love to walk there, just not up in the hills. Oh my God, why you'd ever want to do that? I don't know. Look, I'd love to be on the ground, but you know, like right here, going for a walk in the wilderness. However, I don't want to be with her sat on a cliff, literally 20,000 feet up in the sky. Okay, here we have a man underwater. What's he going to do? Oh no, you're going down super far. I swear if you go down like far enough, the pressure will literally bust your head open. Like your brain will explode out your nose. How was he able to hold his breath that long? I mean, to be fair, whenever I was younger, I tried to do two laps of the swimming pool without like breathing. And I'm not kidding, I nearly drowned. Uh, 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 no, 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 no. Okay, so you know how earlier in the video I was talking about how there was a guy who basically crawled into a cave. He used to love to do it for some reason. He got stuck and they tried to save him for a day and then he basically was just left there to die because they couldn't save him. This is the type of stuff that he does. He literally climbs into little holes that go into caves and just like crawl around in them. I remember once whenever I was younger, I went cave climbing at a place in Northern Ireland. Thinking about it now, I don't know why I done it because it was actually really scary. But look at this. This man will literally be able to suck himself into this cave. I mean, if there was ever, like, an attack where someone was, like, trying to grab your shit, you'd be good to hide in here. But look at the way he's just, oh, he's maneuvering him away. I can't even speak, it's making me feel sick. Watch this. Three, two, one. He just gets swallowed up. He's been swallowed by the earth. He's been sacrificed. You'll never see him again. I'm not kidding. This is actually like a big booty hole of the earth. That man just went into hell. He's never going to be seen again. Okay, so this guy's driving an airplane. Oh my God, look at the way the rain hits him. That's so crazy. I've got a feeling though he's driving into a rainstorm. Oh, whoa, did you just see that? I swear we just seen lightning. Okay, never mind. I thought he was driving into a rainstorm. Apparently he's going to get hit by lightning. Okay, so like, look, he's literally just like... Look, did you see that? Literally, it nearly hit him. Oh my god, lightning is terrifying. Like, I swear if you get hit by lightning, you're basically done. You're toasted. And his airplane nearly got hit by it. Also, can we talk about how that airplane literally looks so thin? Like, that is literally like him riding a go-kart. How people can do that, I will never understand. Okay, here's someone skiing and they're at a cliff. Why? Why? Fuck. Yeah, exactly. It is like scary. Rocks, kind of. Why are you doing that? He's literally clipped in, so this is obviously a thing he wants to do. He didn't, like, ski off the side of the mountain. People do this for enjoyment. Whenever I want to do something that I enjoy, I live stream and TikTok or make YouTube videos. This man apparently climbs up half a mountain and skis. Oh, my God. He's literally clipped in as well by, like, a little harness. Oh, I hate that. I absolutely hate it. I don't like it at all. Look at the way he's just shimming along. That is terrifying. Like, if that literally snapped any minute, he would plummet so far. The thing is, if he plummeted, people would not find his body. He'd either be completely covered in snow, or he would just disintegrate. But yet again, look at this. I don't understand how or why he'd ever want to do this. It's white men, isn't it? It's white American men. Well, at least he survived, I think. Yeah, he did. That was the end of that clip. Thank God it wasn't the end of him. But Lord Almighty, how people can do that, I will never understand. Oh... Watch his fingers. Oh my God, he's trying to break his finger. Now, I'm sorry, that's actually how you're gonna have someone's finger snap into a billion pieces like a breadstick. Absolutely not. Also, recently I budged my toenail in a door, like I slammed it into something. Oh, it makes me feel sick even thinking about it. But basically, I like broke the nail halfway down, so like a new nail grew under it. I ripped it off today. Oh my God, I actually thought I was gonna die. But look, he just goes in the head of the game. Oh my God, what does that even do? They're like builders. Yet again, I don't understand how people can do that. Honestly, these people need a pay rise immediately. This dude is literally free climbing cell force tower in San Francisco. Yet again, American man. Exactly, how is he gonna get down? By the way, these free climbers literally climb up the building without being attached to anything just to climb up it. Why'd you do that? Like, this is literally what you expect in Russia. <laughs> By the way, they're all giggling about it. They should not be giggling. Like, it might be all fun and games, but if you literally see his body drop, uh, uh, no. Oh my God, that's terrifying. I feel like that should definitely be illegal. Like, what we need to do is get people, like the police and helicopters and taser these people and then wrap like a harness around their legs and then just like fly them off somewhere. Fly them to jail. Okay, so obviously this tiger is playing with this person. But imagine if this was in the wild. I wish all tigers were like that. It's literally acting like a puppy dog, like a kitty cat. Oh my God, that's terrifying. Like that thing could literally rip your head off any minute. It's like a video we watched a while ago with the people who live with bears. Any minute the bears could turn around and just like snap on them like they could literally take them out. If you ever get chased by an animal like that, just know it's eating you for dinner. Yeah! 
Oh, they're coming to dawn. Oh my god. She just disappeared. She's gone. What is that? Where did she go? Did she go to heaven? I don't know what happened, but apparently we never seen her again. I'm assuming that's like a zip line and just like zooms you across like the rainforest. I mean, I'd love to do that, but I would be scared of falling off or disappearing like that. Oh my god. Wow, you nearly got taken out by that shit. And why has he got a mask on? I don't know what was going on there, but that was freaky. And surely you'd be able to see that ship coming at you from like a distance. Like you can tell where a ship is. Maybe that was like the police or like maybe it was like pirates. Whenever you think of like pirates, you think of like the 1600s. Pirates still exist, by the way. Like they're still a thing. No, don't do what I think you're going to do. And why would you do that up there? Why? No, don't throw it off, don't. Okay, she looked at the distance. She was just looking down. Not the best thing to do. I mean, one time I was on a hill. I was like walking and I was walking up these steps. I nearly slipped backwards. I'm not even kidding. I would tumble down about four sets of stairs. I love how I'm complaining about that when she's literally doing like a skateboarding trick at the top of a mountain. I'm telling you, these people have the biggest balls ever. Anyways, guys, that's some very, very close calls. I think the majority of these people should definitely be arrested because they are a danger to themselves. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you're from Spook, subscribe button. And Jess, I'll see you all in my next video.